Hey love, so it's me and my daughters again and we are going to do another hair tutorial. This one is also from Miss Bye, and this is their curly bob lace front. It does have three combs in the front as Tati is showing you right here and in the back there is a comb and long with an adjustable strap. So this unit is really curly. It's like kind of like a loose wave and I'm just going to go ahead and braid Tati's front perimeter of her hair. So or excuse me, I'm going to braid her entire hair up in just some small corners so that way the wig can lay super flat in case you guys are not aware Tati did do a video on her latest big chop so you can find that video on my YouTube channel so I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to put the stocking cap on we're not going to be using any glue or tape anything like that to adhere this wig we're just going to do it the old-fashioned way or not the old-fashioned way but just without so you first want to make sure the straps are nicely adjusted so that way the wig can sit flat and just like really close to your head and if it's not bleached, you can use some of your pressed powder like you see me doing here and just use a really dense brush and kind of like put that pressed powder that you use in your face also on the inside of the lace. That way it'll camouflage any type of knots and also make it look really natural. So that is what I'm doing here and I'm also going to be spraying some of my favorite pump it up hairspray on the unit so that way it does stay on meaning the baby not the baby but the press powder stays on so you, as you guys see i am going ahead and just applying that wig to her head and like i said it is a lace front so there are combs all around the unit and it's just super easy to wear now as you guys see here a lot of times ear tabs are really long on a lot of us and the ear tabs kind of like flap they go down too far nobody wants to actually glue or tape those ear tabs down so I just cut them away especially if it's a wig that I'm going to keep I just cut them away so that way I don't worry about those ear tabs in the way and just flapping all over the place um hey I don't have sideburns I think they're called more or less like sideburns and I'm just going to do that on both sides so you want to make sure if that's what you're going to do don't cut it too short it's always best to cut less so that way if it is too much you can still just trim away a little bit at a time so I'm also going to be using some of my lot of body wrapping mousse it's more or less I kind of use it like styling mousse because I'm just trying to get the hairs in the front of her hairline um, wet because I don't want to wet the entire baby hairs with gel I mean it just would make too much of the hair sticky and stiff and I don't want to just saturate her hair down with hair gel so I'm just going to take some of the baby um baby hairs in the front hair perimeter and I'm just going to kind of like dampen it with the styling mousse and that's when I'm going to go ahead and cut into the baby hairs because they were kind of extra long and we really don't want them that long you try to get your wig to look as natural as possible so I did try this got to be clear gel out clear goop clear gel out i have both the yellow and the black bottle and honestly it um it just doesn't dry as fast i think it's just a little bit too wet the clear um to me i just don't think they're the same so i'd rather prefer using the white but that gets kind of flaky so i just went into my pump it up hairspray and spray some of that on the brush along with some on her hair this hairspray is super strong like i said it is one of my favorites between this and aussie i love them both because trust me ladies i will just spray the pump it up on my hairline and the wig is tight like not moving at all I did go ahead and use my gorilla snot gel because that one is already thick and it dries a lot faster than the got to be and it doesn't flake up so I like the hold on it just as well you know what I mean but if you put a little bit of this and a little bit of that got to be huntage your wig will be like tight I've had all of my wigs that I've sprayed with the got to be on my hairline and they were stuck to my skin I didn't have any gel just the, the hairspray alone and that's great and that's it so I'm just gonna go ahead and situate her baby hairs right here and just brush them down and kind of like brush them up into the wig because we don't really want too much baby hairs like too much is just too much so less is still a little bit too much so I try to make it look as natural as possible um, when it comes to baby hairs because you just don't need them all over the place but you want to help camouflage the wig so as for the unit I do believe it's about 150 percent density and it is I think 14 inches in length 14 or 12 inches in length I do believe it's like 14 inches and um, it does come with a middle part but I went ahead and put in a um, right part for her I did tweeze a little bit of it because the knots might have been just a little bit dense than normal and um, we didn't cut it but this wig is actually straight out the box meaning I just took it out the box today and just styled it so I am going to put a little bit of 
my own like touch on to the unit like i said it is like a loose wave um wig but it does need a little bit of oomph in it so i'm going to take one of my barrel curlers which is my favorite you guys see me use this all the time and i'm just going to take the smallest barrel which is very tiny and i'm just going to curl little bits and pieces of the unit so that way it just it's popping it doesn't look like it's just laid there tati actually does like this one a lot she also likes the first one that she did get as well from Miss Buy, which we did a few weeks ago. And this one is, that one was a lot longer and it was a loose wave. Uh, I think it was a 360. And she loved it as well. But she loves this one also because it's not as long, so it's less maintenance. And this is something, and I think it's also because it's a little bit more fuller. So, yeah, she really does like this one a lot. You can just wash it and it'll curl right up. So, if you're wondering, does it curl right up after you wash it? It definitely does. If you want more volume, you can always hang it upside down to dry and you'll get even more um, volume. So, all I'm doing now is just wrapping the hair around the barrel really quick and not just holding it on for like a couple of seconds. You don't want the curls too tight because the unit is like a loose wave. So, I just wrap it around and probably hold it on for like one or two seconds and then I'll just remove it really quickly. Miss Buy does have some super affordable lace front wigs, so you may just want to stop on through and check them out. There's always a coupon box code in the description box for Miss Buy, so make sure you check that out. The unit was really affordable. Um, they do have some really great packaging. You do get like some amenities, cute little freebies and gifts and such. Now, just to make the blend, the lace blend in just seamlessly, I'm just going to use some of her pressed powder around the edges, just so that way it just blended in and everything just goes together, you know, just perfectly. Um, Tati is something else when it comes to just blow drying her hair and such like Tati is a real work of art she really doesn't like too much heat on her skin or her scalp and that just makes my job a little bit harder but I will tell you this she's so much fun to work with and I'm so glad that she allows me just to style her hair and just you know put the wigs on her because it's fun for her fun for me and she gets to keep the wigs so I think that's like the great part about it so you guys I hope you enjoyed this video with me and my daughter once again make sure you check her other one out make sure you check MissBuy.com out I'll post all of the information for this unit in the description box below and on that note stay tuned for the remaining video or the ending because there are some funny bloopers at the end as well. The slayage has been done by the OG wig slayer right here. Okay. <laughs> Subscribe. Follow her on her Instagram. All her social media. Support. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> you better not. <laughs> I'm not in my scalp. You're fucking it up, my video. Oh my god. Ew, your face is horrible. <laughs> Could you move up so? Let's see how it's just... You know, I, I haven't been seeing much love today. It's it like he like proceeds with the love and it's like pimp slaps me too. Get out of my video. Go. Put your black face.